after a long last day of work, like today, I finished. So yeah. I'll probably yeah. go home and have a steak or something like yeah. that because it's like I've earned it a little bit. So you're getting a reward for working. But what did that cow have to go put through in order to reward you? Have you I'm seen what happens person. to animals? I'm not going to watch Why not? That. You know why I didn't when I, yeah. you see me? Because I didn't want to get turned off with my dinner. Got me in a circle, yeah. I can't lie, yeah. yeah. The sign says uh, animals deserve human rights, yeah. change my mind. Mm -hmm. And what do you think about this statement? We're basically animals ourselves, if that's basically to explain it. But we're the animals on top of the food chain. It's basic human nature from when we was created or if you believe in evolution or if you believe in creation, whatever you believe in. What do you in, believe in? Um, nothing. I don't believe in any other two because I'm just a, a, a specimen on this earth. Like, okay. We're like a speck of dust or something okay. like that. We're insignificant and very significant at the same time. But okay. yeah, we, seem to, we seem to think as human beings, because we've built all of these sort of things and we have things, we have like watches or any sort of thing or jewelry, we feel like we are gods or we're at the top of our vision, but really we're just basic animals because basic instinct is to make sure we have a roof over our head, health, and also multiplying or just having kids and yeah, all yeah. that. Some people don't have that, but my brain that caught my eye with this and I understand where you're coming from if you were talking about like factories and when it comes to the way humans treat animals and stuff like yeah. that and that but primarily before, yeah, yeah primarily but before all of this used to happen um as a basic cave caveman or homo sapien our job as a man or for you as a man yeah would be to go out find food and come back and protect your your people like your wild lynch your, like, your kids yeah, yeah. or your wife and that was the only way of survival the only that reason was, why, yeah. yeah the only reason why we're here is because of the fact that these homo sapiens did that for us like where literally you're the i'm the last of my generation that made it this far like we've all lived billions of years we don't know what happened before the limeline and i'm not gonna act like I did. a lot of bad things yeah. happened in history for, for, in order for us to be here 100%. right now in civilization yeah, like you, you know we had slavery we had yeah. wars we had war crimes we have uh you know horrible things happening to yeah. animals and humans yeah pillage and things yeah. like that along the way. Mm -hmm. But now, yeah. we don't have a justification to do yeah. what we're doing to them. We can no, get, we, we, we can have plant foods and, mm -hmm. you know. Let me just give you my position so yeah. you know. So, yeah. yeah. Okay. So, what we what we share in common with animals mm -hmm. is we are both sentient. Yeah. Uh, we mm -hmm. both uh, have uh, emotions. We both yeah. care about our families. Mm -hmm. Now, there are degrees to this, yeah. but I'm saying the degree to which animals do mm -hmm is enough to, for them to be respected and have rights yeah. because we are not in some situation where I'm cho have to choose my family member yeah. or a chicken. Oh, chicken, yeah, yeah. We're in a situation where you it's a chicken burger. You could choose other options. We've got loads of other chicken, options. That's true. Yeah, yeah. Let's just say we did, human beings didn't have rights, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. You'd be it, able there's to nothing stopping from other There's nothing stopping yeah. us from, from grabbing of, uh, two smaller them, humans, yeah. grabbing them, enslaving them, killing them, eating them, you know. But they got rights. we will go to jail forever, you know. You know. So basically, without human rights, it's fair game. You know, it's survival of the fittest at that point. But so can I explain something to you? as well okay my girlfriend's pescatarian and she pescatarian fish, yeah fish. i think fish and uh veg food as well but i've always wondered i want to know what brought you to this side of saying plants it's um, my only way because really and truly let's put it this way as me as a physical person i need protein i do eat meat i'm not gonna be around the bush i eat meat but i do that because I want to make sure me as a person. You think you, do, you, think you need to do it to look after your health? Yes, yeah, is what yeah, you're saying. Pretty much. But if so, you didn't, then do you think it would be justified to do what we do to animals? To not animals? at all. I still okay. don't think it's justified because even as human beings, as human beings, we would get treated wrong. But what I'm trying to say is the sign. I'm not disagreeing with you, but I'm saying the sign's a bit wrong because we are animals. We are ourselves, so yeah. it should be right. I get it. All right, sort I of get you. exactly where we are. Right. Yeah, yeah, I hate, yeah, no, you're right. The sign is a little yeah. Yeah, because human but beings are technically a category of yeah. We're, yeah. we're a category, category of, animals. of animals, but we're I, just I on top said, of our food I, just, chain. I couldn't say non-human animals. Yeah. And, no, I understand you know, that. I would say non-human farmed animals yeah, like yeah, chickens and pigs yeah. and cows and fish. That's the yeah. only reason why I came and yeah. I was drawn to it is because I just feel yeah. when I was coming. Yeah. I and I understand all of this, but I don't know how to get to the point to explain this. But okay, brother. What okay, let me, let me, so you, you mentioned a few things. You said that if you found out you can get, because obviously we are yeah. pretty much, yeah, like, like you got a nice yeah. peak. I've been and training you now, well. I've, I've got a bit of and fat you, around. You, you, you don't eat me, do you? Not for 10 years. For, not for 10 years and we part the same stuff. Yeah, Okay. So all plant foods contain all nine essential, I mean, no acids. I've been told about yeah. one plant that actually does better than They all meat. do. Yeah. So even lettuce, right? Yeah. Have mm -hmm. you seen this? Because basically protein deficiency... Oh, I don't want to say this, but I might win your argument by saying this because cows technically eat grass and we eat cows because of that part because yeah. they eat grass to get They've that got protein. four stomachs though. Yeah. You could get mm. lettuce. Yeah. All right, let's go 2,000 calories because that's about what you need in a yeah. day. It's just to prove even lettuce, which I don't just eat lettuce. Yeah. I eat a wide variety right. of plant foods right. and, and some are high in protein like tofu and tempeh and beans and legumes mm -hmm. are all high in protein. 
but lettuce even has 123 grams of protein. That's about mm. what I need, 1.6 uh, mm. per pound of body yeah. weight for my, uh, that's about the higher range. Okay, yeah. Fiber, iron, maxed mm. out, calcium, maxed out. It's got everything still E12, no, but supplement B12, you have to. That's lettuce, one plant food I just picked. Yeah. You know, you get carrots, you yeah. do the same thing. That's true. Bananas, you can do the same yeah. thing, and you need a lot more bananas. You need to eat a wide variety of whole plant foods. Yeah. Lower in saturated fat, no cholesterol, good for your heart, good for your, your mind, your body. But why does it, humans go back to still put animals into cages and have a corporation like McDonald's and all of these other ones? I'll be honest with you. Um, How do we justify violating animals to such a horrible degree that if done to humans, it would be the next Holocaust or the yeah. next transatlantic yeah. slave trade? Yeah. It would be so f bad. Mm -hmm. Human rights, uh, Universal Declaration of Human Rights came in after the Holocaust. Yeah. It was like, well, that's... Yeah. Yeah, it you know, should have come in. Definitely should have come in earlier. The only thing I can say to that is like, yeah, if you're out in the wild, a lion will still eat a gazelle. Um, and why do they like, do that? They've not no other choice to. Okay. But you're saying we've got choices we and we've do, got though. options. But that's the thing with us human beings. When the more options we get, the less we want to use those options because we live in a day and age where, again. People work nine to fives all day long and yeah. then go back to a box no, house. They're still in slavery, yeah. but they don't think they are in yeah. their own It's mind. a kind of mental slavery yeah. based on the monetary system. Yeah, yeah I, I, I hear that. So they, they don't, don't have food. time to make these yeah. decisions so and become aware. Just like, you know you, what, this is easy you and know what, brother? You've had time to become aware. True. You sound True. like a pretty I am aware, a light bulb kind of... That's, yeah. that's the thing for me, though. So, I'm used to... Have you I'm seen what happens to animals? I don't, I've seen a few with the you McDonald's stuff. You've now. seen a little? I'm not going to watch that. Why not? That. Tell me why. You know why I didn't? Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But you know why I didn't when I first, uh, was it you, you see me? Because I didn't want to get turned off with my dinner. Because oh. I knew that if I saw no, it, but I didn't I'm, want to change. Yeah, but I'm a strange, I'm weird when it comes to that. I'd watch and still go and eat like food because I don't know. It's just my basic go-to like instinct. Like, if they were humans, would you, would you eat them? No. That would be different because, yeah. Why is it different? It's, we're if animals. Yeah, we are animals, and if it was humans, it would be different. Let's say if me, okay, if apocalyptically uh, we was the last people. Why is it not, morally different? Why is it morally different? I put it this way to you because the fact is, yeah, again, I go back to it, we're at the top of the food chain, and really and truly, like, it's there, it's put there for us. What do you mean by top of the food chain? Um, I, I'm just trying to go back to basics. Because I asked you what, so what the mo what's the morally, morals, yeah. moral, it's morally so wrong. Is yeah. it morally justified if we are the most? Uh, so I, I guess what you mean by top of the food chain, we're the most powerful, smartest yeah. animal. Yeah. So just because we're more powerful, we're more smart. Does not mean. Does that, that mean we're know. justified in getting killing those who are vulnerable and easy to manipulate no, and easy to? Because that's how a narcissistic think, and that's how people start out. It's not exactly. justifiable. Exactly. But at the same time, I came here to try argue against your point, and you're making you're pushing me this way a little bit more. And it's I'm having you, yeah, yeah because you seem like a, a logically consistent yeah. person with yeah. a good heart, and you yeah. don't seem like you have any reason to be defensive. Yeah. You just really want to get yeah. to the truth of things, yeah. right? Yeah. I like going to the core of yeah. something, and that's why I came here and had this conversation yeah. because I was going to walk past and I just thought, let me ask because when I see the sign, that sign was the only thing that got me off. I understand where you're coming from with your stuff, and I, I respect it when people do hold to their own and stick to this, this but it's a little difficult because yeah i don't know i'm used to this sort of lifestyle of course, and, but, and of course of so i'll tell you I'd my story to you if i said i'd change i spent 12 years taking drugs and in gangs and i ended up in prison for gun crime i uh, got caught with a loaded gun and i did six months in prison and got sober in prison that's the yeah. longest i've ever been sober, been sober yeah. so when i so become I've sober i was like awareness yeah. man bird's yeah. eye view and i could mm. see things yeah i seen i was hurting people my family things you've never noticed before yeah, yeah I've i was been been i was like bomb punch people i didn't even think that bro yeah like i didn't yeah. think of the effect yeah, it's it's having like on other people having, yeah i could see a lot that. of people don't that's nah. the problem with this world and that's the problem it's like throwing it's almost like let's put it this way you've got a grenade you throw that grenade behind you and you've walked off and you don't look see back. the trail of but destruction as soon as you turn back and see the trail of destruction then you have to say oh my yeah, god what have i done like, yeah yeah and that's that's, that's what happened to me that's what the sudden realization but the problem with that is a lot of people will never have that they'll I die only, i only have a conversation with you yeah I'm only talking oh, to you, bro. You, I don't yeah, give I a f what everyone else is doing I right know. now. I'm I talking know. to you. Uh, yeah. You have the power. Yeah. So when I yeah. got out of prison, right, yeah. I started thinking, wait a second, I don't want to be violent. Yeah. And where do animals fit into this? I always yeah. say I care about dogs. I would never f kill a dog if yeah. anyone hurt a dog. Mm -hmm. But I've got a cow on my plate. Mm -hmm. How how do I justify this? And I felt like a hypocrite. Yeah. No, I get what you mean with that. So, but that's yeah. So, but you said you said to me you can't see yourself changing your lifestyle. I took yeah. I, I I quit drugs. Yeah. I quit alcohol. Yeah. I quit I all really, the animal products I do and I become drugs a vegan. Or anything, but my thing is, 
yeah, I can't lie to you. Like after a long last day of work, like today I finished, so yeah. I'll probably yeah. go home and have a steak or something like yeah. that because that's like it's like I've earned it a little bit, and it sounds bad. I don't want to be saying this like sort of thing, but that's you're being honest. Yeah, that's like my go-to, and it's like a routine. So, so you've been routine. rewarded, right? Yeah. So you're getting a reward for working. But what did mm -hmm. that cow have to go put through in order to reward you? His life was built to get to that point to be put on a plate. got murdered so, for you. Yeah, it's literally, yeah, it had. So it, they got murdered to reward you for five minutes, yeah. 10 minutes after her yeah, work? Or less, or less than that. Yeah. And I understand where you come from when it comes to that point. But again, yeah, I don't want to sound harsh or anything, but that's, yeah, I still would go back and do the same thing because I've had this conversation with a lot of different people, vegans and pescetarians about it. But I understand and I feel for it, but at the same time, I'm not gonna lie and be around the bush. I don't see you as a violent person or a heartless person, no. but if I had a cow here about to cut their head off and say, here's your steak, here's your reward, and that cow was bellowing but out, you, have to you would understand. tell me to stop? Would you tell uh, me to stop? No, because let me put it this way. You I'm would allow in. me to... Let me finish yeah. before you say, I'm going in, yeah? Sorry, bro. I'm going in, and before I came to this country, I was eight years old. We literally had to kill the chickens ourselves to eat. Or well, we had to kill the goats ourselves to have food. We didn't have to, but this is like, we had to do the whole process of like taking off the feathers of the chicken. Like we literally saw it from it's been like it to it dying. Like, Did they want to die? Because Did you of feel? Of course not. Did yeah, they struggle a bit? Yeah, struggle, but you have to understand like that was the only sort of food for us to back there. Like we could like, Oh. I was raising a farm, like, sort of thing, a guy named farm. I had a pet, like, the goats were, like, my pets and stuff like that, and I'd still have to... And how do you feel animal. about killing them? It might sound hard, but I just saw it them as the As food. they had yeah. to do it. And how do you think it the was, goats felt? But, Betrayed? Yeah, yeah, because I'll be honest with you, my dad told me, like, this is what you have to go through. Like you have to understand. Like this is it, and that's it. Maybe if you so talk you were a young way, yeah, that's a lot. It's a heavy I'm thing. Seven, I'm seven yeah. years old or something like that, and I just yeah, it's been already immensely put. So your dad said, you know what? Let this is go. a sanctuary for these animals. We're not going to kill them. It doesn't have to be this yeah. way. It might have been different. Up, yeah. yeah. It might but, have been different, but it's because I've been raised that way. I've sort of been numb to it almost, let me yeah. put it that way. So, yeah, the fact is, if I was to see a video, you show me a video of something like that, I'd still be able to go along and go eat, but I'd become numb to it because I've gone through the process of... I'm numb You have to use your... I, I, used to be, I used to be numb to human violence. How did you change it? Empathy is something that you have to really develop and I've put yourself... Empathy, but you you have to be able to put yourself yeah, in the in position... The shoes, yeah. Yeah. And it's difficult with animals because they don't look yeah. like you. But if you see me yeah. getting stabbed with something and yeah, eat, I'd want to protect. Yeah. But, but with a cow, you're like, how do they, how are they experiencing casual. that? Yeah. Yeah. And it, then you got to think like, you know, if I stomped on that pigeon there, you yeah. go, why did you do that? And I said, yeah. you know what? Yeah. I rewarded it's it. Like, rewards me after so a good day at work. You know. Would you say the same thing when it comes to let's say bugs, spiders, and all of that? Uh, so oh, so you don't count that. Why why so is that differentiated? I don't feel the same about yeah. because uh, the experience of say an ant or a, or a, some sort of bug. Yeah. Yeah. is vastly so when Different. you when, yeah because yeah. like because of the way that say cows and birds and but i see and fish, cows and birds the same as ants and butterflies and all well and, they're almost on par with the sentience of like yeah. small children yeah so they're nowhere near a bug but a, a bug is like they have like almost trivial sentience yeah. in, in many uh, aspects but somebody would gonna... argue that's not the case because let's put it this way like trees are put on here so oxygen you know understand the way trees work and stuff like that by the same time people we cut down trees to build wood or yeah build trees aren't sentient they don't have brain yeah. functioning nervous no, system but i'm saying yeah. as in the animals around those trees like yeah. they keep those develops like an animal would eat from one tree and move on to the next one like the re i don't know how to explain because i'm not that smart don't think no no that's right no i get what you're saying uh, an animal will go from one or even bees they would pollinate one uh flower and move on to the next one De them doing all these little things that's actually helping us out that we don't even realize like so yeah yeah, yeah. they're important I, I don't i don't think it's okay to yeah. just deliberately exploit yeah, and kill yeah, them but yeah. i don't look at a bee the same as so i look at a pig okay, okay. it's just like i might i might see that there's a gradient in in sentience and yeah. if i care about their conscious experience if they've got a tiny little conscious experience there and they'll live for two days yeah. they're not going to be the same as a cow or a pig or a human True. Yeah, you know what but I mean? those two days seem like a lifetime. But, they, but a cow matters way more yeah. than your taste buds, way more than your preferences to eat them. Their life matters way more than your reward after work. What would your idealistic world be? Vegan world. A Where animals world, had yeah. rights, non-human animals had but rights. From there, yeah. there would be more population, because let me put it this way to you. A bigger We've population got, of Yeah, a bigger population of oh. animals and people, because we, right now, Why? we're populating the world way too much. Like, I, I feel like, I don't know how many people are on this earth right now, but more and more, 
somebody's dying right now, and another person's died, and another people person's die. being born. Less people are having kids now than, they, than yeah. ever in history, yeah. I think. And the reason why is because there's not enough. There's too many of us, like, in some population. Well, I think places, it's a bad distribution but... of resources, brother. Like, it's not that there's too many people. It's that we're, we're growing a bunch of plants to feed to animals to then eat the animals. It's a hugely inefficient yeah. process. Yeah, because they've got factories that are built to just for food. Just literally, yeah. um, a chicken will be put in that factory. And fed a bunch of soy yeah, and a bunch of... To yeah. be put out there, McDonald's or KFC on all yeah. these places. It's inefficient. Feel, it's, yeah, Feeding it's animals inefficient. is inefficient. But, at the same time, so what, what would you say back to what I was saying, like when I was a child in Ghana, we'd literally have to hunt for our own food or like sort it out like that. That's a primal thing. That's why I keep trying to go back to it's like, it's primarily built in us, like no matter how like we can You know, I've had, I've had to do some violent things, man, mm -hmm. in and, and people have had to kill in situations yeah. and, you know. Yeah, it's kill a, or be killed. There, yeah, in those situations, yeah. we're not talking about that yeah. now, man. You're yeah. not in a survival situation now. I'm yeah. not having to go shoot Pull a gun out on no. someone and we protect my family. We can go to the shop and buy something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're talking about you got five quid. I can go get a steak. That's yeah. what you're talking about. But I'm it's convenience about... for people. That's yeah. also and the that case. And that doesn't though. justify killing. It doesn't. But people will always rather be convenient than justify. You. Do you rather be convenient? Are you, when you say I'll people, honest, yeah. Okay, I'll be honest with you. Yeah, to a certain point. Point. I've tried like being vegetarian or trying not to eat meat, but it's something in my taste buds that has been made like no matter what. I'm always good on. Yeah, it's hard happening. to change your t habit, you know, yeah. you got to prep it. But, uh, so how did just... you change it? That's what I want to know. So basically, really. I, just, I just made a commitment then. I made a commitment because I have pr my uh, my principles. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, so I felt like, well, where are my principles now? Mm -hmm. And if I don't change myself now, my, my, this is what happened. Yeah. I was on house arrest mm -hmm. and I seen this raw foodist guy and he was like, it was about weight loss first. And then he started talking about karma and animals and I was like, oh, f karma, like that happens yeah. in the gang world. So then when I went to, I was still drinking drugs and I was doing this juice diet, lost a lot of mm. weight. The plants made me feel like the raw yeah. plants made me feel good. I was like, mm -hmm. wow, I lost a bunch of weight. When I got to prison, I yeah. got sober mm -hmm. and the seed about karma, mm -hmm. it stayed with me. Mm -hmm. So when I got out, yeah. I was talking to my mum and I was sober and I was you know, about to leave the gangs and that. And I said to mum, why are you smoking? Like smoking's bad for you. Like, mm -hmm. like you I thought I was like, I was like a halo on my head now. Mm. She's like, what do you mean? Like, there's a lot of things that people don't change. And so, then, and do you then, reckon people have to go through that first to be at that point, yeah, to, or no, 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 what? like, it depends. Yeah. Some people. So basically, mm -hmm. I had a personal realization when Mum said that to me. Right? Mm -hmm. I felt like a hypocrite. Yeah. I'm a hypocrite. Yeah. I'm asking her to do something that I haven't even I changed. Yeah. So I, I made a personal change, right? But some people just hate what happens to animals or doesn't don't think it's justified yeah. and they're like well how can i avoid this mm -hmm. oh i just had to buy something else at the supermarket have tofu or seitan or mock meat or yeah. beyond burgers instead of a yeah. decapitated chicken yeah. then i'm going to do that yeah you know? But again, people are still like the meat supplements and everything like that. People are still trying to taste like the sort of meat thing because, yeah, I've seen, I've tried like vegan stuff and I've tried like to, it's literally trying to imitate meat almost. Yeah, which is so because like, you like the taste. Yeah. Don't you? So yeah. we have to, so, in order to help the animals, uh -huh. we have to put these these things in to, to get meat eaters off the animals to save the animals. Got me in a circle, yeah, I can't lie, yeah. yeah. Me, you know, I think so. But I understand where you're coming from. Me personally, yeah, uh, I'll, let's talk about me sort of thing. And I'll be honest with you, yeah, the way I have been raised, like I would, if I had kids, I would want them to, yeah, try have the vegetarian lifestyle or like a good lifestyle because we've been put, we are the next generation and we, like my mom brought me to this country to make sure I'm further ahead than she was when she was growing up. So for me, I have to do the same for my kids. So would, if you, that teach, means, would you teach them empathy yeah, and compassion to animals? 100% because my girl likes her. That's why she's a pescatarian, but she still likes fish. Fish, but fish, fish is still fish the same. Sentient. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. But she still likes fish, but she can't help because she's Spanish and that's been built into it's her. No life, excuse. Sort of yeah, that's I could I'm make saying. excuses for everything yeah. in my life. You know what yeah. I did? I had accountability mm -hmm. and I said, it's not good enough. I've got to change. Yeah. But, All these are yeah. just excuses. No, I know that, but I don't want to yeah. uh, like yeah. say this, all of this, like, yeah, tomorrow I'm going to be no, vegan. Of course and no, you're being that, honest with me. Which is I'll be I'm being honest with you, yeah. though. Too. And yeah, that's yeah, what yeah, I respect. Yeah. But I'm trying to, like, I always want to learn better because me, my brain, the way my brain works is it, if I can learn this, I can learn another thing. If I can learn this, like, I don't think there's anything that I can't do. Uh, if you I know put that. your mindset, I can tell. Yeah, like, that's the way life I is meant tell, to man. be. That's what and, and so when you say to me, oh man, I like the taste of this, yeah. and I don't know if I can, that's all bullshit. Yeah, that's all bullshit, you can do it. Yeah, but now you got me thinking, yeah, I know that, but now you got me thinking like, how 
do I want to, or is it like me trying to know it's that? It's not about you. Yeah. It's, it's, you're doing, it's something you're doing for others, man. Yeah. It's right. the reason I don't, if that, if I, it's the reason I go walking up, punching people in the head. No. It was a good others. conversation, bro, but I've got to go, because right, I've been here ages, but Sorry, honestly, I didn't see you bro? going that way. Myron. Myron. Myron, Myron, Myron really nice talking to you, Myron. Joey, bro. Joey, nice Joey. to meet you. Best of luck with your Scan this yeah. vegan info if you want to learn. No, I've got one, I've got one. Okay, yeah, but yeah, but you said you're going to learn? Yeah, I actually might give a Give me your word. Give me your word. Give me I'll a word that you'll look, you'll look, I'll into, look it. into it. I'll look into it. I promise uh, you I'll look into it because me, I'm a type of person. I look, as told you, I want to learn everything. Like, I think this world's like the oyster. If you don't explore, there's no point like, in anything. But best Peace, brother. Take thing. care, mate. He was a nice bloke, wasn't he? He was really trying to understand and be honest with me. He wasn't deliberately being cruel. He's just like, this is how I was brought up and this and that. I didn't feel dishonesty from him. When you have your first conversation about it, like, or second even, third, it's not gonna fully sink in. And he's like, no, 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 don't show me. But if I see it, it won't do anything to me. But he didn't want to see it. That's interesting, isn't it? Don't show me, but if I see it, it won't change me.